In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect a PS4 controller to iPhone. So let's get right into the video. Just letting you guys know, I'm doing a giveaway at 20,000 subscribers. If you guys want to be part of it, all you guys got to do is subscribe, turn on post notification, and leave a comment why you deserve to win with your Twitter or Instagram handle. All right. Good luck to everyone. Let's get back to the video. If you so happen to play Fortnite and you would like to support me, use code JTF, it's three letter JTF. I will greatly appreciate it. And this is an ad, hashtag ad. All right, so as usual, the best way for me to show you guys how to do it is just to do it myself. So this, you guys are on my phone. Right now I have the current uh, iPhone 11 max pro or pro max whatever that's what i have right now and um, i'm gonna go to settings and this is where you want to go you want to go after you go to setting you want to go to general oh, you want to go to bluetooth which is here make sure your bluetooth is on this is where you want to turn on your ps4 controller all right you're going to hit the playstation button and the share button right here so that's what i want to do and uh you're gonna hold it until it's flash. All right, you see that flash? Now, now you wanna, it shows the DualShock 4 wireless controller. That's pretty much your PS4 controller. You know, click on that and uh, it's gonna connect. Once it's connected, you're ready to use. The color is already highlighted. Right now, I'm gonna jump to Fortnite and show you guys some gameplay. So, let me get on Fortnite. And it should work. I'm just going to show you guys the basic. I'm going to get on creative or something. Ooh, all right. All right. Huh? All right. So I'm, I'm going to be back when it's all updated. So BRB. <clears throat> okay. So I just load up on Fortnite. I'm just getting on creative to show you guys some of the moves. And this is still wireless. Like you guys can see on the phone as well, it's loading. Moving. I'm just gonna get get on one of these. Oh, I'm in with the controller. Boy, mm. pretty good. And so I would, everything looks pretty fine if you're playing on the mobile, but if I was looking on my screen right here, it looks really bad. But if, on the mobile, it looks pretty crisp. But the FPS is still. It's still pretty bad. It's all right. I mean, some people don't have console or PC, so they're playing on mobile. Maybe this is one way to help you play a little bit better. But uh, pretty good. All the button looks. All the buttons working. Rotation is working. Weapon. So, so I don't have a weapon to switch back and forth. That's why I, I've been trying to hit triangle and nothing worked. The only thing is um, your Y. It looked like I'll have, let's say I have my Xbox controller, but it's really PS4. But um, let me try to get into another. The hub. Oh, you. Where's creative? I, I mean, I, I am in creative. But I don't know much about this. Get it on Misty Meadows. We get some items. Try to build a little bit. Everything looks pretty fine to me. I'm still work. I'm still using it. Oh, 
But yeah, if you guys have any other video ideas, you guys think I should do? Okay, so I'm hitting, I'm hitting the triangle button, right? It's fine. It looks pretty good. Just on the screen, it looks kind of glitchy, but on the mobile, it looks fine. Okay. And, uh, yeah. So, I'll just say that's pretty much for this video here. Thank you for watching, and uh, like I can say, you guys have any other videos you guys wish I make, let me know in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace out. All right, so another thing I want to mention is uh, there's no turn off button for the PS4 controller for the iPhone. So if you want to turn off the PS4 controller when it's connected to the Bluetooth on the iPhone, you, you got to manually go to settings and uh, forget the device so you can or turn off your Bluetooth so it won't connect. All right. That's what that's another thing I want to say. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much for this video. So thank you for watching. I really do appreciate it. you guys all supporting me. Channel is going to hopefully hit 20K either the end of January. That's what I'm aiming for. If not. Fe Fe February would be good too. I can't even say February. But have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.